It's a wild life, so let's just play some games. Oh my god, I can't f***ing catch it though. Jesus. Those are so f***ing rare, are you kidding me? Don't invite others. Battle ends when Pokemon faint four times, or the battle lasts for ten turns. Fine. Let's just go. There ain't no one around. <laughs> I'll just summon these strangers. Uh, we got play rough though. You're golden. Good on you guys. Yes. Yeah. All right. One more. Let's do it. What? Am I, can I not catch it? I don't, kind of don't want it anyway. And it's gone anyway. Oh, I guess I can. Yeah. Those are cool once this happens. The earth shakes. I mean, won't it always catch it? Mask dark, everyone. Check out a song, Deox is in the Ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Good one, you douche. No experience, huh? Jesus. Well, we got these candies, better disperse them. <laughs> oh, look at it ride around. Because it's going through the changes. Ch -ch 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 changes! Damn, it's a fing rock star right now. I'm toxicity, the toxicity! <laughs> the short time is an aggressive Pokemon chug stagnant water to absorb any toxins that might contain. So cool, my dude. Oh, yeah. So Nuzzle, Nuzzle's really useful. It's like better than Thunder Wave. What am I gonna f***ing want, Growl? Can you, do we have Sludge Bomb? Ah, oh, these things can bend you in half. <laughs> it looks like it's been around forever too, since Gen 1. Dude, level 46, I'm so gonna beat this guy. Ah, oh, no. That was a crit. Oh. Dude, no! Oh. <sighs> Pokedoll time. <laughs> the way it hit its face. Good. That was intense. <laughs> How they all stand? Oh, that one stands. We're gonna take down that motherfucker who beat us at the coffee shop. Oh yeah, remember when I edited his name to be Random Mid Bastard Bernard? Well, I don't feel like editing it as such again. Sorry, cry more. Great. Fuck off. Good. Ugh, oh, Dinotion, don't drop acid in the middle of a battle. Ugh, rock stars. Cool, the crit made up for the fact that Razor Leaf didn't hit it. Look how that worked out. Dude, what's with Razor Leaf? Johnny fell in love. Of course he did. Ah! Damn it! Dude, I'm gonna revive it. I need it. I need to have experience. Oh, jeez, that's not what I meant to do. Of course. The ability is punk rock, or is that too? Hey, <laughs> I hope that battle's refreshing and smooth again. Yep, thanks for the money. 
That was a bad ass. I like him as a cup of rosary tea. Here's a treat, I promise. Well, I'd rather you give me rosary tea. Missed opportunity, Pokemon Shield. This team's been through a lot, so it's what I'm using, no matter what type of we got in here. Dragon? Hemlock Stadium doubles as an energy plant. Now, have a look at my tablet. <laughs> I've got all the information you need on it. Okay. I see an easy to understand description of the energy plant. You know, it's got quantum theories on it. Plus, energy is absorbed from the Hemlock Stadium's tower, then it's changed into electricity in an underground power plant and delivered to people throughout the region. Our lives and society require various types of energy sources such as electricity, natural gas, and water. My associate groups aim to improve everyone's lives by harnessing the power stored in wishing stars. Don't forget to mention that. Oh, it's time for me to get to work. I should get a move on before Oleana decides to give me another earful. Oh, uh, y'all perverts. It's dependency, I suggest you head over to the vault next. Just head toward Route 6 from the stadium and you should find the vault without any issues. You need to get a set of gym badges if you want to face the dragon type easily, Rihanna. Don't even know what to make you. You've got a grass type, you've got a fire type, an electric type, a water type, psychic, ice type, but frost loss will take over that. I'm not feeling Sylveon. This will be an Umbreon. Hey, what's good? Stupendously, he seems to be doing well collecting gym badges. But Hop, did something happen with him? He was acting really odd when I ran into him. He took one look at me and immediately was like, I'm so sorry, Lee. Wouldn't be the first time I've heard him bother us anything, and I've had, and I had no idea what it was for. Maybe he's feeling down because he's had some hard losses in battle. He lost to that challenger today. When you lose, you fell down in the dumps, but then there's nowhere left to go but back up. You've got to think on why it was your loss, though. You know, that little brother of mine, I think he might yet become a surprisingly great trainer. Blast, and look at the time. Nearly forgot my meeting with the chairman. That Oleana really lets me hear it when I'm late. Now, if only I could remember which way to go. Anyway, I'd say that you should go and say hello to Rayon while you're here. Stupendous to he's a great forever I've got. And the final hurdle you'll have to face in the gym challenge. He should still be around the vault if you hurry. It's down that way on the way to Route 6. Thank you. See you. Love you. Wow, the evidence is really piling up. My five favorite Pokemon. I, I didn't ask you. Out of my way. Oh, if it isn't a trainer dressed by the champion. Let's see, what was your name again? <laughs> I was high for days, so I forgot. All oh, right, stupendously. If Leon himself recognizes your potential, then I guess he'll grow into quite the trainer. All the same, though, anyone wanting to challenge the mighty Rihanna has to prove they're up to it by earning seven gym badges first. We need permission if you want to enter the vault. Cool, do we go in now? Once you here to see the vault that goes up there too, you know, Miss Clever. Oh, that's what Rayon said. This person didn't say that. How about like used to be that very sensitive? The Gala region. We keep historical treasures in the vault. It's just up the stairs there. Oops. Well, <laughs> the way I jolted it up. And I haven't earned a gym badge for a long while, so this better not take long. Ooh, fun times. You have a deep voice, don't you? Oh, yeah, yeah. Brilliant, aren't they? It's great that there are still treasure tapestries that can tell us of Galar's history. The two youths watching a wishing star. A disaster occurs, the two bewildered youths. The youths looking on at the sword and shield that stopped the disaster. The youths being crowned. These tapestries tell the story of the creation of a kingdom in Galar. I love the red and black. Maybe the game should have been red and black. Say young Jim Challenger, what sticks out to you most about them? There's two heroes. Bang on, that statue at that hotel in Motherstoke only had one hero, no matter how you slice him. But here, we clearly have two youths. Was it really only one hero, or were there two, and what even caused the darkest day? Thanks for letting me bounce some ideas off you. I think I've got some theories now. I'm going to research the tapestries a tad more. You have your gym challenge, right? I'm cheering for you, so take a couple of these. I hope to see more of your wins. Great! Win! I forgot how fly I look. Ooh, let's get our Dark Souls on.
<laughs> Work that pose. That'll get as big as as uh, Leon's pose, I'm sure. The tapestries in the vault depict the heroes of the Gala Regents past. I suppose if you got any, if we got any modern hero, it'd have to be a champion, Leon. Listen up, stupendously. Yeah. Do so stupendously. Your goal is to defeat that superstar Leon, so go conquer Route 6 and train yourself up along with the stone on side. I probably don't have to train all that much because I did a ton before I came in this town. What are you waving at? Katina! Uh, what? Katina! Toxo are so cool, I really really want one. If you got a Toxo, would you please trade it for my token piece? It's evolved, so you probably don't want it anymore. Actually, I want it more than ever! It's awesome! Well, it, it was never yours, I don't know what to tell you. Not for a Togepi. Wow, so sunny up here. It's actually morning right now. I Is this how mornings look? That'd be awesome! What a cute silicobra. cobra. Just look at those adorable eyes. Okay, Jesse and James, I I don't have a ton of time here. So our duty has teamed you out to make sure Silicobra cobra gets a nice peaceful sleep. Hello there, if I promise not to wake the Pokemon, will you let me through? Of course, it'd be our pleasure. Okay. This is a strange development. Oh hey, stupendously, you're heading to Snow on side, right? Oi, Team Gap, yeah, don't suppose you'll let us through. Nah, you kids are way too loud. Can't be letting you through. And we're particularly not fond of kids wearing the challenge band. We thought you have stopping it around Silicon Cobra and show to wake up! Esperobo from Yu-Gi-Oh, anyone? Right. What do you say, stupendously? If you don't get past that, we won't be able to continue our gym challenge at Snow on side. Let me think. I don't figure thinking at them is going to change much about the situation. I know, I know. Till next time, okay? Bye. 